true confidence, lasting impression. You will use your true confidence skills and what you have learned about how to gather knowledge and be prepared to help deliver the promise of true hospitality. But how can you show guests and colleagues that you have mastered true confidence? To help develop your true confidence skills further, we are going to take a look at how to confidently represent the hotel and how to deliver useful information with confidence. True confidence is about being proactive. For example, Samin, a front desk colleague, is available and ready to be of service. She notices the guest, and by reading the guest's body language, she realizes the guest is in need of assistance. She doesn't wait for the guest to come to her, but has the confidence to approach the guest instead. Samin's confidence lets the guest know that she can trust her. The guest has asked about good restaurants in the area. From past experience, Samin knows that guests often ask this kind of question, so she's prepared with the information the guest requested. She uses her knowledge of the local area to recommend a restaurant. Throughout the interaction, Samin stays calm and composed. Did you notice her body language? She has shown you how to confidently represent the hotel. You have learned that it's important to communicate positively, both verbally and non-verbally. Just like attitude, confidence is also communicated through behavior. So it's important to look and act professional. You should sound calm and reassuring. Never be too loud or shout. And always speak respectfully. When interacting with guests, stand up straight, make eye contact, and smile. Eye contact shows the guest you genuinely care about satisfying their needs, while a smile indicates you are friendly and approachable. You should always deliver useful information with confidence. Do you see how uncertain Becca, a food and beverage colleague, seems when a guest asks her a question? Although she is prepared and sure about her answer, the way she presents the information means the guest isn't sure whether to believe her or not. Even the most accurate knowledge delivered without confidence can lead the guest to question that information. As soon as Becca shows her confidence to the guest, letting it come through in her voice and body language, the guest can see that her information is reliable. Becca uses her knowledge. She is confident that she has the right information, and this means she creates trust with the guest. This allows her to give the guest the best possible service. That is true confidence and true hospitality in action. It's time for you to reflect on what you have learned 